so hello everyone my name is ravindra in this video we will see how to create and developer account for all microsoft services for free 100% developer account for microsoft 365 e file license that includes enter all the applications like microsoft power platform sharepoint data wars and so on okay so let's uh, jump to the <coughs> microsoft 365 developer center okay uh, you will get the link of this uh, Web site into an comment box as well as in the description box. Okay, simply on it is uh, which things are including in Microsoft 365 Developer Program. Okay, before that, uh, please watch the complete video because this is very important uh, steps we follow in this video. We, you will make some mistakes. Okay, while creating developer account, so be stuck with me. Yeah, let's go. So. This is a free developer instant sandbox account. As here you can be see, this is renewable after 90 days. Okay, means if you do some activities, okay, in your account, then it will automatically renew for 90 days. If you not done, then it will be close the services from Microsoft. Okay, after 90 days. After that, you will get some sample data package include Teams and others. In the Microsoft 365 account, you will get the your domain name after that dot on microsoft.com this is your last domain okay this is renewable if i license and uh, you can add up to 25 users all office apps you will get here okay advanced security power bi analytics and so on okay so all the things you will get here let's uh, i switch the tab so in this you can be see the cost of microsoft 365 if i license as per indian currencies 4475 user per month okay and gst extra applicable okay so here you can be see in this license everything microsoft 365 e3 license plus advanced security and compliance capabilities clever business analytics with power bi and audio conferencing okay so means this all the things okay like one tb cloud storage chat meeting file shares okay Office Rishwa apps for desktop and mobile, Windows for enterprise, core security integration. This all the things you will get plus the these three services. Okay, and this entire source of application you will get like Word, Excel, PowerPoint, Windows, Teams, Viva Connection, Viva Engage, Microsoft List, Form, Power Apps, Loops, Clipcharm, Power Automate, Power Virtual Agents, Power BI Pro. Okay. Microsoft Planner. So this all the things you will get. Okay. So let's go and see how to create this. Okay. So let's uh, simply you have to click uh, on the join now. Okay. Let's we click join now. So it will land to the second page. Okay. So, it's, so here it is asking if you are signed into the your account. Okay. It is sim simply ask you for the sign in. Okay. Let's we go and uh, choose other ways to sign in. Okay. Let's give one step back. Sign with Microsoft. Here it is asking for Microsoft account. Okay. Let's we create here new one. Okay. So you will understand and completely. Just simply click on the get new email address. Okay. And just click your name here, Ravindra. About two thousand and two. Okay. So simply click on the next okay let's we set the password here i setting the password let's click on the next let's provide the name for that i just copy this into my clipboard so it will go cd okay let's select the region country let's we save our password to the chrome as well Let's select the entry country. Let's do the date of birth in May. Let's click on the name. You have to provide your birth, date of birth, and other things here. Okay. Please solve the puzzle. We will not. Okay. So let's we have to solve one puzzle here. Use the arrows to the rotate the object to face direction of the hand.
verification completed okay let's we go to the next step so here you can be see we are provided the our outlook account here okay let's uh, select the country they wants company name okay let's i give the name Ravi. Okay. preferred language english let's accept accept click on the next what is your primary focus as a developer for personal project let's we choose here okay click on the next here we have to select all the things okay and just click on the save So set up your uh, Microsoft 360 E5 sandbox license. Okay. So instant sandbox provides us include everything needed built in Microsoft 365 app. Okay. And here it is asking from scratch. Okay. So we will select the instant one. Okay. And let's click on the next. Here we will give the state North America CA. Okay. In your case, you have to select a case. Okay. Which you have to provide admin username okay so let's i give my username admin okay so let's uh, we provided a password and just simply click on the continue let's uh, here we have to provide the mobile number okay So uh, you have to take care here, okay. While you are giving the phone number, okay, you have to provide the mobile number, okay, uh, that is not already created developer account, okay. By using one single mobile number, you can be created only single developer account. You have to keep it in your mind, okay. So let's click on the setup account. So setting up your developer account, okay. It's taking some time. Let's wait here for a couple of minutes. So you can be see here, okay. It takes uh, five minutes, but welcome Ravindra Dado. Your Microsoft Switchware Developer Program was created with E5 license, okay. So all the applications we are just created. Yes. So here you can be see our developer account was created, and here we get domain name six W J C zero Z seven on Microsoft.com. So let's we copy this email address, okay. Let's go. So now let's we open Microsoft Edge here, okay? And let's click on this icon, okay? Profile icon. You can be seen the left hand side as well as in some of cases you see in the right hand side, okay? So let's we click here, okay? After clicking that, just go to the other, okay? Set up new work profile. Just click here, set up new work profile. After that, add a new account, select sign in with data, add your email address, and just sign in, okay? In my case, I already sign in, okay? So I just go to that account. So you can be see this is our account. After signing, you, you are landing to the, this type of page here. Okay. So what you have to do, you can be just go to this nine dots and just click on the Microsoft 365 accounts or simply this home icon. Also, you can be able to click. Just simply click on Microsoft account and which application you have to open. Okay. So simply you search here. Let's say I have to open like Power Apps. So I will type Power Apps. If I have to open Power BI, so let's type Power BI. If I have to open SharePoint, so let's we type SharePoint and so on. Okay, so any application you can be open from here simply. So your developer account is created for SharePoint, Power BI, Power Apps, and so on. Okay, if you have any questions, you can be asked me in the comments box. Okay, thank you, friends. Have a nice day. Or if you have some suggestions, also you can provide the suggestions.